How to detect fake honey? Did you know that honey is one of the healthiest foods on the planet because honey contains high amounts of vitamins and minerals? The experts say that the type of vitamins and minerals and their quantity depends on the type of flowers used for apiculture. Honey has antibacterial and antifungal properties, so it is often used as a natural antiseptic in traditional medicines. Honey contains nutraceuticals, which are very effective for the removal of free radicals from the body. But, the real and ugly truth, due to its high price, is that people usually buy the cheapest one they can find in the supermarket sometimes the one in the best looking, most dazzling container. Now you probably ask yourself, why? Well, because when you buy this type of honey, you're not actually buying pure honey. Here's what you need to know, a recent study, conducted by a group of experts at the Food Safety News, has discovered that up to 76% of all types of honey available in supermarkets have been subjected to a process called ultrafiltration. What this means, well, this filtration process removes impurities like wax traces, but also the pollen as well, which is a bad thing. You should also know that the honey manufacturers say that this process is important in order to prevent crystallizing and to prolong the shelf life of their products. The bad thing is that many consumers don't know the fact that pollen is extremely important and beneficial to our bodies. This is very important for you to remember, the main reason why you should avoid honey that's been treated with this type of process is that you can't locate the geographical origin of the honey, as in cases of pollen contamination, the origin needs to be analyzed and traced. Adulterated honey is honey that is not in its purest possible form. Some people also say that adulterated honey is often sold in the supermarkets, so you should learn how to recognize it. Don't forget if your honey does not crystallize after some time, there is a good chance it may be adulterated, since the pure one will crystallize when kept in the fridge. Always read the label on the honey, and if it contains commercial glucose or high fructose corn syrup, avoid it. You should definitely try this simple trick, you just have to add a few iodine drops into a glass of water and add in some honey afterwards. If your honey turns a blue color it has been combined with corn starch. Or, you can try this method as well, just add a couple of drops of vinegar into a mixture of water with honey. If you see foam, your honey has been adulterated with plaster. Some people use this trick as well, you can burn the honey with phosphorus or a match, and if it ignites, it is pure honey. Or, just place a spoon of honey into a glass of water, in case the honey does not dissolve, it is pure, fake honey or per quality honey dissolves in water due to the high adulteration.